Welcome. I'm going to show you how to edit the sticker mock-up in Photopea. So just go to photopea.com in any web browser. And then you want to click open from computer to open the mock-up. And I've already got it open in this tab here. So I'm going to be doing a lot of work in this layers panel. So if you don't see the layers panel, just go to window and then click on layers to bring it up. And then you just want to click the arrow in the sticker layer to expand the layer group. And then double click the thumbnail icon in the design dash sticker layer. This is going to bring up our smart object where you can copy and paste your design. And then just go to file open and find your design in the computer. And then it's just going to load for a few seconds. And when it's done loading, just go to select all and then edit copy and then click back on the smart object tab and go to edit paste and you might want to resize this I'm just going to press control minus to zoom out on my PC on a Mac it's command minus and to resize it simply go to edit free transform and zoom out a little more and then just click and drag any of the four corners to resize it. And once you're done sizing it, you can just go to File, Save Smart Object to save the smart object. And once it says Smart Object updated up there, you can click the X to close the original graphics and the Smart Object tab. And you'll see it put the design on the sticker just like that. Um, there are several options here. So you can have a border if you want one. Just click the box next to the border dash sticker layer to turn that on. And then to change the color and width of the border, you can double click on this word stroke under effects. And that's going to open up the layer panel. Layer style panel, okay. And then to change the color, you just want to click this little color swatch with stroke selected here. And that's going to bring up our color picker. And you can just click anywhere in the rainbow slider to change the color. And then click in the gradiated box to change the lightness and darkness of that color. You could also enter color values here if you know them. And you can change the width just by clicking this dot next to size and dragging it to the right to make it wider or the left to make it narrower. And if you wanted a gradient instead of a color, you could just click this menu next to fill type and change color to gradient. And if you wanted to change the color of the sticker, like say your design was transparent and you could see the color through it, um, I'm just going to click the eye icon to turn the design off so you can see. If you want to change the color of the sticker, just double click the thumbnail icon in the color dash sticker layer. And that'll bring up a color picker again. You can just click anywhere in the rainbow slider to change the color and click in the gradiated box to change the lightness and darkness of the color. Or you can enter color values if you know them. You can also adjust the shadows underneath the sticker. To do that, just click the arrow next to shadows and then click on the shadow layer and then click the down arrow next to opacity and drag the slider to the right to make it darker or the left to make it more subtle. Depending on the color of the sticker you might want the shadow to be lighter or darker. And depending on which mock-up you purchased you might have different shapes for the sticker which is fine they're all the same. 
and you might also have different backgrounds depending on which mock-up you purchased. So to toggle through your backgrounds, just click the arrow next to the backgrounds layer group. And then just click the eye icons on and off to toggle through your different backgrounds. And when you find one you like, um, you can just save it. If you're going to use this as a thumbnail on a website like Etsy, you'll want to save a version as a JPEG. To do that, just go to File, Export as JPEG. If you want the layered PSD file with your design in it, you could come back here again a second time and just go to File, Save as PSD. That's all there is to editing the sticker mockup in Photopea. Please message me at melissabmockups.com if you have any questions. And don't forget to like, subscribe so you get updates to future videos. And as always, this mockup and other mockups are available at melissabmockups.com. Thank you.